All right, you guys, check it out. I got the GoPro fully duct taped to the rope here. So let's head over there, start tossing this and see if it works. What is going on today, guys? Today, we're gonna be doing some more magnet fishing, but as you can tell by the thumbnail, I'm gonna be taking a GoPro, I'm gonna duct tape this sucker to the rope, and I'm gonna point the camera down at the magnet. We've magnet fished these docks so many times, we've found so much crazy stuff. I think it would be super cool to be able to see the stuff that we find attached to the magnet as we catch it. So hopefully this works out pretty good. Now, I am out here with Alex today, guys. If you would like to check out his channel, I will leave a link down in the description. So we're gonna get right down to it, guys. We're gonna attach this GoPro to this rope. We're gonna start dipping around and we're gonna see if we can find anything here today. If you guys would like to pick up some merch or you wanna pick up a magnet, the links will be down in the description, guys. All right, you guys, so here is the plan. I have my big 360 degree magnet with me. I got some duct tape and I have another GoPro. We're gonna take this GoPro, we're gonna duct tape it maybe somewhere right around here or something. We're gonna point it down at the magnet magnet and when we're dragging it on the bottom of the river in theory no matter how this rope spins the camera should stay pointing at the magnet and we should be able to see whatever we pick up the only downside is going to be once i duct tape this thing to the rope i'm not going to be able to check the footage and see if it's really working until i get home so fingers crossed you guys hopefully this turns out no way holy cow you guys hold on before i do this Look at what Alex just found. Ha <laughs> ha. Dude, no way. Oh, look at this all bent up. Right? Holy smokes. It reminds me of one of those like kitty ones that you like hit the trigger <laughs> or something. But yeah, I that's know, definitely dude. a button push one. Yeah, for sure, dude. Holy wow. cow. Dude, I'm at a, I'm at a hot spot right now. Nice. To come all the way I'm telling here. you, yeah. Now, how exactly am I going to duct tape this? to this i don't really know i don't i can't cover the camera obviously all right i got one layer of duct tape on there and it's already holding on pretty good you guys and i got the all weatherproof duct tape here so this should work under the water pretty good all right you guys check it out i got the gopro fully duct taped to the rope here so let's head over there start tossing this and see if it works there we go i can see the red light we are live you guys we're definitely recording here let's give it a shot let's toss this thing under the dock and let's see if we can find anything today okay. no way oh it's still got the lid roller on it yeah i like don't check even it touch out that, dude i've never no. seen that before that's cool Look at this Norway 420 Norvec huh is that just Norway in a different language I don't what know maybe Norvec Ooh, right here. I think I just went over something, guys. Am I pulling on something? Come on. I think it felt like it, ain't it? Oh, yeah, a little something on here, guys. Something's sticking off the bottom. First finds of the day with the old GoPro attached. What do we got here? Looks like part of a bag on the bottom there, but look at this thing, you guys. Oh, look at that. It's a little flathead screwdriver. Holy cow, man. Look at the handle on that thing. That just looks old. That is super cool. The old tiny handle flathead screwdriver. Like I said, I can't check the footage because that thing is duct taped right up. So I'm not going to know if it even worked, if we saw it on the camera or not until I get home. Let's get that thing back down there and see if we can find anything else. Bingo, cash money, baby. Look at what's on there. Heck yeah, you guys. And again, man, I wonder if we caught that sucker on the GoPro on the underwater camera. Whoa, look at what Alex has. What are you talking about? Dude. <laughs> oh, dude. Ooh, watch our, our magnets. We're starting to oh, suck. Oh, they really? Hold yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. Right <laughs> <laughs> but check that out, dude. We got a nail clipper, 
uh, another can opener, another pair of pliers, and, <laughs> and I got a pocket knife of criminal evidence. <laughs> <laughs> Holy cow, you guys! This one is pretty shiny looking. Yet, what does that say on there? Can't really tell. Oh, look at that! There's like a symbol on there. I can't really tell what that is you guys that's kind of cool oh it's like a knife with a hammer symbol huh what the heck kind of brand is that now we got the old pocket knife and the old flat tip screwdriver <laughs> Skibbity doo da, skibbity day. You guys, look at the sky right now. Look at all of these clouds in every direction. There's clouds as far as you can see, and look, the sun is poking out for like we got five seconds left here, and then she's gone. Ooh, right there. The heck is that? Oh boy. That one's got some weight. No, it came off. Come on. Is that on or what? Feels like I got something. Feels a little heavier. Oh, there is something on the bottom of there, guys. Look at this. Ooh. Check that one out, man. We got us a. This one's at least more than just the can bottom or can top we don't got us a full can there but check that one out guys what do we got i think it's uh yeah, the old budweiser holy cow that sucker looks old well that one's definitely not shelf worthy what do you got dude no way holy cow man you're on a roll yeah, over here sure, bro. dude um, <laughs> splash yeah right bro. splish and splash holy cow man the zebco it doesn't look too terribly old honestly well until you look at the handle look at that I sucker guess, yeah it almost looks <laughs> like no one ever took like the tag off and it's the, uh, <laughs> that's the crazy dude it. isn't that weird this like, isn't even the whole like pole a stolen pole or something who knows <laughs> Is that crazy? It's missing the whole top though. It's, it's an extent, yeah, it's, it's sure, a two piece. Sure. And I'm not gonna know what it is if I don't get it, nope. Came right off. Felt like some fishing line, honestly. You know, nothing on there. I see a little nail, but we'll go back under, see if we can get something else. Right there. Ooh, is that just mud there? Or what the heck am I pulling on already? Oh, maybe it's more fishing line. I bet you there's tons of fishing line down there, you guys. I bet. Oh, look at what's on the top of there, man. We got us a pair of pliers. All right, you guys. I love coming to this dock spot. Oh, look at that. I even got it working again. You guys, there is always some cool stuff in here. As many times as we've been here and as much stuff as we pulled out, Every time I come back, I think there just can't be anything left. And we just continue to pull stuff out. It's unreal. Oh, look at that, you guys. I didn't even really notice that one on there. Check that out. What is that? Twist top burger beer. Yeah, I've definitely never heard of that one before. A burger beer. I don't know if I would drink that one. What do you got? Oh, bingo. Small Dude, you're killing it over yeah, here. The old big lighter. The old big. You ain't light nothing with that oh, thing. Oh, no, it's over. All right, guys, let's get back under there, man. I'm liking this. I really hope this footage turns out. Look at that, just a big old nail, but look at this, we got the top to a Zippo. Man, it's too bad the whole rest of it didn't come up too. Go, dude. What do you got? Oh, oh this was a dude. Oh my goodness. I thought this was gonna be like a single knife. You but guys, dude, this it, is it unreal. It works, dude, it works, yes. Unreal, I found one that looks almost just like really? that, dude, yes. Let's see if we can get the rest of the pieces out. Oh, not really, they're kind of It's not gonna take there much cleaning go. to get no. that going though. Dude, nice. Unreal, man. Oh, I just took a sniff of my magnet. Dude, it smells like oil. Look it, there's actually oil stains on my magnet. 
<laughs> there is. <laughs> oh, look at what you just caught. Yeah, I was busy <laughs> laughing about you smelling your magnet. <laughs> Smell, look at There's oil stains on there. You can see it. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, that's funny. Uh, well, look at this, you guys. It he caught me like, all beat up like in on that. The thing that you scoop goldfish out when you buy them. <laughs> oh! Look at what's on there, you guys. Check it out. We got the old fishing reel handle. We're just missing the whole reel. Here, we'll take Alex's fishing pole, we'll connect us a reel, and we're going fishing, baby. Ha <laughs> you guys, that is crazy. Ooh, what is that? Just dirt, mud. That actually feels kind of heavy, guys. What am I pulling here? Whoa! Oh, don't fall, don't slip. Dude, look at what we got here, you guys. Looks like a couple things. Heck yeah, man. Oh, no way. First of all, look at, we got a pliers too, dude. But you guys, check this can out. This is like absolutely perfect condition just about. The only hole is right on the seam here. No Look at, um, I think it's, what is that, Schlitz? World. That Schlitz is, beer, oh, dude, no way. Have you? Yeah, that's that old, is. that sucker's old, man. Oh, look at, they can share. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and boom, baby, we got us another pair of pliers. Holy smokes, man. So now we got us two pairs of pliers. <laughs> What is that? Oh my, there's something there. Fishing line or am I actually pulling on something? I don't know. Kind of feels like fishing line, honestly. Yeah. Pop, pop, pop. I can feel it pulling. Yep, and it snapped. That was definitely fishing line. Oh, looks like there is something on there though. Yeah. Whoa, you guys, look at this fingernail clippers. But look at, hold on a second. Look on the inside there. What the heck? Look at the little design on there. There's two little fishes. Look at this fingernail clipper, dude. What? It's got the little oh, fishes on there. check it out. <laughs> that's, that's cool. That's how you know that that's for like cutting fishing lines. Right, like yeah, it's, it's got the old fisher. trimming your nails necessarily. That's cool. Oh, that's a, that's a hook remover, an old school fish hook remover. Explain how this I found a couple of these before. Oh, so you so think like if a pinches in there? Yeah, is if a hook is way down in a fish's throat, you stick that down there, you grab the hook and you kind of, and it just, really? you can like pull way down in their throat. Yep. It's kind of like a pliers, but it works yeah. better because it's way longer. Ooh, what the, get off of that. Oh, what's that right there? Oh, yeah. Oh, I got something. It's actually... No, 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 no. Where'd I go? Is that it right there? Yes. I got it. Come on. Nice and easy. Stay on there. Heck, yeah. This one's got some nice weight. What is this one, you guys? Ooh. Look at what it is. Hold on. Yeah, can you go down there and grab that? Snap! Oh no, did it fall? Oh man. Oh, there's something else on there though, you guys. We're trying to get this chair back up. And look it, we got us an old school, I think they call this a church key. It's like an old school bottle opener. Yeah. It's been a while since I found one like this, you guys. I'm pretty sure these are pretty old. Compared to all the other ones that we found today. Oh, look at it. It's stamped on there. What does it say? Oshkosh. Some Oshkosh Brewery? Oshkosh Brewing? Something. Holy cow. That's pretty cool. It is. I got it. 
Hey, good time to get ready. Here it comes, you guys. Stay on there this time. Come on. Come on. Get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Yes, dude. Woo! That took a couple tries, you guys. Holy cow. Dude, it's like a crocheted. Oh, it is. <laughs> that's kind of cool. It is super cool, dude. Now that's a fishing lure dude, snagger. Oh, oh, that stinks. Oh, my God. It does stink. <laughs> oh Holy God. cow, man. Oh, I opened that bad boy. Up. Ugh, it smells rotten. <laughs> Holy cow, you guys. Check this chair out. It's literally like a cloth or like a knit it's like thread that is super cool yeah it's like a homemade chair dude now this type of material i would think would grab lots of fishing lures off of fishing poles right. here but i don't see even a single one on there you guys and it almost didn't even really seem magnetic i don't know how the heck i even caught that thing it's crazy Oh, what is that? Oh, I just heard something click pretty hard there. Is there something on there or no? Heck yeah, there is, dude. I heard that sucker click. Check that one out. Oh, look at this, too. What the heck is this? Whoa. Is that a battery? Oh, there's like some wires attached to it. There's some black electrical duct tape i don't know what the heck to think of that one that does look pretty funky what does that say there, energy some energy something enter cell i don't know what you're running on that one but check this out yeah i got me another pair of players oh look at what else is on there dude another church another church key we have like 10 pairs of pliers for the day holy cow you guys so i got my second church key and i think this is what our third pair of players at least for me i don't know how many you got jump you guys look at now we got our second church key i don't know what this one says we are killing it Oh, what is that? Feeling something there. Oh my gosh. Oh. Yeah, that doesn't really want to move. Is it just a a log or what the heck is that? Probably can see it on the camera there, but I don't know what it is. I don't know what is going on there. Oh, dude, are you kidding me, man? The very Holy next throw, I got another pair of players. <laughs> Holy cow, it's, it's like they're, they gotta be just sitting in piles down yeah. there. This is nuts. You know, I wonder how long has this dock been in? Uh, you know, I don't know for sure. You know, I don't know. Uh, I think uh, for a few years. It's gotta be a while. I'd like to say at least 20 years. Is it? Yeah. Think so? I don't know for sure because I've only lived here like four years. Sure. Back under we go. I thought I felt something decent down there unless i was oh so i don't know what's going on here oh boy that doesn't feel good uh, yeah what the uh oh whoa dude i don't know what that was i don't like that maybe a pillar from the dock or something maybe i caught that on the camera if it's even still attached holy cow you guys i had to crank on that oh look at oh ooh, there's something on there but look at how close i pulled the the camera down to the magnet oh my goodness That's you guys hold on yeah it's still oh, yeah, recording yeah, yeah. yep it's but look it's at you guys out, i caught oh my gosh That's even nicer than dude the one that, that I is that's before. way nicer than the one you is found the same numbers at norway norway 204 oh, what is yours mine was 420 420 yeah. mine's 204 it's, it's the same numbers yeah, just right, mixed right, up right, that's right, crazy right, what do you got Group, uh, what oh, what the heck? Is that say? plastic? How'd you catch that? Oh, it's magnetic. Really? Yeah, it's magnetic. Whoa, look at that, you guys. The old cottage cheese Ooh, lid. I can't try to take a Low stab fat. at that name, though. I can't pronounce that. No, what does that say? It. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, Cavanaugh? I don't know what that <laughs> says. Cloverleaf? That's what it says. You know what it, says? it says Cloverleaf Cottage Cheese. Did I get it? I can't really tell. Oh, dude, no way. I got me another can. 
And look at dude, it's in good condition too. Holy cow. It still has like a lot of the Ooh. color on there as well. That's heck yeah. Kind of washed away and look at it, it's a Schlitz again. Yeah. Dude, no way. The beer that made Milwaukee famous. A lot of local brews back then, man. Dude, that's crazy. Look at how good of condition that's still in you guys. It's like it was preserved in the mud. We are <laughs> definitely cleaning this one up and putting that one on the shelf. And look at what else was stuck on the magnet. I got me the old minnow oh, net. You got one too? Nice. You ain't scooping yeah, no minnows yeah. with that one though. Look <laughs> at that, it's all busted up. Oh, I'm telling you, dude, there's something right here. Something decent. Is it on this time? No. It doesn't want to come up. I am going to be interested to see what this is on the camera when we get home. <laughs> because there's something right here, you guys, and I can't quite get it. Maybe the old Kloschke could do the job, but I don't really know. Oh, that one hit the, the dock. Ooh, there's something right there. I just stuck. Ooh, something else. Oh. Ooh. Oh, yeah. I feel some weight. Whoa, dude. Look at this throw. Holy cow, man. Is that a fishing pole? Oh, yeah, this is. It's a fishing pole holder. This is like a super old school one. You stick her in the grass like that or wherever. And you put your pole in there, you go old fishing. But I caught me another pair of pliers, dude. I don't even know how many I have now, like four? This is nuts. A toolbox, I caught a whole toolbox. Look at this, we have literally an entire stack uh, of tools here, mostly pliers. A couple pocket knives here. We got some old school church keys. This is crazy, you guys. Ah! you guys that is gonna wrap our video up here for today definitely a super successful day man like 10 out of 10 we definitely made out of here with some cash money today you guys now like i said with the gopro you guys i can't check it i'm not gonna know how it looks until i get home if it looks pretty good I don't see any reason why I shouldn't keep throwing that thing on there every single time. All right, guys, so I'm gonna pack everything up and I'm gonna get out of here for today. If you guys enjoyed this video, please make sure to hit that thumbs up button for me and don't forget to subscribe, guys. Make sure to stay tuned and I will catch you on the next one.